our, our look around here. I want to ask you guys about Damian Lillard's story here, talking about how his life is so lonely. I believe the, the article came out from Chris Mannix. Um, you know, he said that he has no regrets about his big boy decision to seek a trade after 11 years with the Trailblazers, but the transition has been tough for the newly single NBA star who filed for divorce from his college sweetheart a week after he was dealt from Portland to Milwaukee. Uh, he said, it definitely felt, it's definitely lonely because I'm such a, a family guy. My life is family. After games, I would come out and have family be back here. My kids would be coming out of play room, my mom, my brother, my cousins. You know what I mean? Um, and now he says that uh, he really said he doesn't do anything. You know, um, what, what did he, I'm trying to see see where, uh, well, I, can't, I can't see the, the quote where he talked about, like, he's like, he's like playing video games, he sits around the house. Uh, goes to practice and basically doesn't do anything saying like that he's boxing bored. videos on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. So I thought it was interesting. Um, so the media, of course, ran with it. The, oh, he's bored in Milwaukee, which again, not exactly what, what he was saying, but a- another time where Damian Lillard, just the media savviness of it, where it's just like, is it what you're saying? No. Are you being and, and again, there is this fine line of being real in interviews and you know and wanting to tell the truth and wanting to get your your, your stuff out there, but there's also again this line of of knowing how that's going to come across. And maybe he didn't know that they would take it as he was bored in Milwaukee. Maybe he just didn't know that. But again, it just seems like a misstep. And and again, it's one thing to have one. So one thing to have one thing where okay maybe that was kind of misconstrued, I mean but but it, but at this point I mean it's it's just like a bad shooting night. It's one thing to have one bad shooting night, but when you pile them together and on and on top of each other back, then it becomes it's like what are you what are you doing? Like you just had your top five list misconstrued as you know, and he's like oh well that's not that big of a deal. Then you're all you know just seeing you're upset, and then here where it's like well I'm so lonely. Like I mean. I, 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 yeah, I, I, again, I'm not saying that, you know, that he was, that that was what he was portraying. But again, when you, when you give those answers, you give the media the momentum and you give them the ammo to come at you. Um, and so that's what they did. And, you know, so now it looks like, why, what is wrong? Does he not like Milwaukee? And, and, and again, but, it, but I, I'll add to it. These, these missteps didn't just start all star weekend and beyond. These missteps started. So it just shows me the process with Damian Lillard's off. Because these missteps started back when he was trying to request his trade from Portland. That was a total miscalculation. I'm only going to Miami. That didn't work. Like, so how many times are you going to, like, so, so that, that started then when people were like, what are you doing? Like, you're not going to give Portland an opportunity to trade to, you're not going to give them a few teams to kind of, no, I'm going to, and he thought, and it backfired on him. So it's like, like at some point, you got to figure this out. I know, again, we talk about being in Portland and nobody caring and, you know, you're able to kind of do whatever you want because you're the, you're the godchild in Portland. That is no longer the case. The scrutiny is there. The eyes are there. Uh, and, again, I, I – so more people get mad. I understand Dame was not saying he was bored in Milwaukee. I understand. But the media twisted his words, and they were – again, he gave them the ammo is what I'm saying. This makes no sense. Like, listen, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call it how I see it here. This makes absolutely no sense from Damian Lillard. And this is another head scratching thing here, right? Because he talks about Portland. My best friends were in Portland. My family was in Portland. They could come over to we go to my mom's house. My mom's and everybody else would be there. And I had this community and everything in Portland. But that wasn't enough to make you want to stay, right? Like you wanted to go to Miami. So what were you gonna move? Was the plan to move every single person out to Miami? Right. Like, I don't I don't I don't understand. Right. Like, I, we're not being honest here. Right. The reality of it is, is you wanted to go look at BBLs and you didn't <laughs> see that. And that's not walking. Around. That's why you want to go. That's why you want to go to Miami. That's the you truth. wanted to go from the practice truth. to South Beach and go look at BBLs and stay out in clubs till 6 a.m. if you wanted to. And you wanted the your choice of women and, and you wanted to party and live the Miami lifestyle. And now you're in Milwaukee and you're realizing that you missed what you had in Portland. I can't. I can't. Like, Dane, listen, you got to figure this out. Right. You got to you, you, you have to come up with a consistent. You got to do something. I, and I, I, I refuse to believe that this 10 year vet does not have any media training and does not have an agent or somebody to get in his ear and say, listen, every single thing you say, because you're one of the polarizing figures in the NBA, especially this season, every single thing you say has a chance to go one of two ways, either positively or negatively. Right. So we got to think before we speak here. 
And we got to really think through this because now if I'm on another team, right? I, yeah, I'm talking trash today. Oh, I might, I might have jokes like, yeah. So, uh, you know, yeah. How, how we doing in Milwaukee? Right. Hey, I check YouTube for you. There's no boxing videos. Tonight, right. <laughs> like, I, I, like I, I'm just going to be on like, Oh, call of duty. You don't got nobody gamer tag, bro. What you mean? You lonely. Like what? Like, Oh, you know, like, I, Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm on him. I'm on his head now, right? I am 100% all, all, all on his head now because he's saying that. And yeah, it just does not make any sense. And this is another just... Go- no, you good. Go. Okay, I was going to say, this is just another goofy thing that Dame has done where he, he has something the media is going to run with. I don't think... Maybe he meant it this way. Maybe he didn't mean it this way. But here's what he's not doing, and that's thinking. 